And you know who makes PBA seasons more exciting aside from, you know, the presumed team to beat? Mm -hmm. Well, it's of course the young, scrappy, and hungry underdogs. And for the PBA season opening on Sunday, the Colombian Jeep vow to bounce back. Lino Lavario has the report. The new year brings new hope for the Colombian Jeep. The team is coming off a disastrous 43rd season, only finishing with six wins in 33 games, with a single victory each in the Philippine and Governor's Cup. For coach John Adel Cardell, who replaced Ricky Dandan, the team's series of failures is just tough to swallow. Siyempre, hindi, hindi makawala yung, ano, yung downside mo. Siyempre, di ba, for how many games, 11 games, then nanalo lang ako ng isa. Siyempre, parang nakaka-depress, di ba? Ang oh, hirap patulog. Nung ito, nagtatalo-talo kami dito, talagang may time na relasyon ng teammate namin, relasyon namin sa coach. Siyempre, minsan hindi nagiging okay. It's talagang normal yun. Enough is enough. The Colombian Jeep want to get things right. In fact, they started their practice as early as the final series between Magnolia and Alaska. We just don't want to be a, uh, like a, a check mark on someone's schedule. Like a lot of teams may look at, look at us at the beginning of the year when they get the schedule and see Colombia and may see like, oh, that's an easy game. No, we don't want it to be like that. Hindi tulad ng dati, hindi pinakawalan ng Jeep ang kanilang top pick. CJ Perez is expected to lead Colombian this upcoming season. Actually, tinanggap ko na kung ano yung role ko. May pressure naman, pero syempre, kailangan natin ano, i-handle yun. Kasi, ano eh, uh, kung hindi natin makokontrol yun, mahihirapan ako eh. Aside from Perez, Coach John will also rely on prized rookies such as Letran's JP Calvo, UST's GP Faundo, and AAC Cyrus Tabi. Yung hinahanap kasi ni Coach Diyan is yung kung paano, yung, kung paano, yung, paano magdala ng team. Hindi naman more of scoring ang big man. Ang tinitignan naman kasi ng coaches ngayon, sa ngayon kasi, hindi siya yung about scoring. Kung okay na maka-score ka, pero mas maganda, mas priority as a big man yung defense. Hindi basta-basta ang unang assignment ng Colombian. Yan ay walang iba kung hindi ang powerhouse San Miguel. Can they handle the beermen who now have Terence Romeo? Magandang opportunity sa amin na uh, may ilabas kung ano yung kaya namin. Ano. Kasi first game namin. So, doon namin makikita talaga kung may ibubuga kami o wala. Nakaka-excite kalaban sila. For News 5, Lynn Olivario, We Are One News.